Hello, Real Verde. It's Daryl Janice and Dave Alm coming to you from this beautiful Friday morning. Tonight, if you see some things flying around, you see some UFOs out there, do not call 911. It's just us playing a little bit of glow ball out there tonight. So it should be a lot of fun. We're yeah. going to do a 5 o'clock registration and 6 o'clock. We are sold out. But because we're sold out, the 40 that were on standby, we put them on for the February 11th. It's going to be our next glow ball that we'll do. So some information will be coming out for that. And also want to remind everybody about cart pass. So today being Friday, quail run, handicap flags can now start to use the rough on the cart pass side. All others were asking to stay on the cart path. We'll probably do this for a week. And then next week, handicap flags will be able to go on the fairways. Everybody else will be able to go into the rough on the cart pass side. So Dave, what's going on in your world? Well, you know, great follow up to last night, wine buy uh, for Fantastic. the holiday season, over 240 cases sold last night comparative to last year of only 160 cases what a blowout we had over 300 members and guests here uh, so what a great event everybody had a great time uh, and again because it was such a blowout we're gonna actually going to extend those prices until monday great. close of business monday and then chris will be back and we'll be able to get all that wine ordered so if you didn't get a chance to partake uh, attached to this email you'll see a link to the holiday wine buy package click on that pick the wines you want Give Chris a call, shoot him an email, and we'll get those on the order for you. Also coming up. Sunday extension menu, right? Mm -hmm. Excited, we're now gonna extend Sundays. The lunch menu is gonna expand to what we have on Mondays. Uh, we will offer food service until three o'clock and then five o'clock for uh, beverages at the bar. So, you know, we heard some feedback from the Sunday couples groups, obviously understand we wanna make sure we give a great experience on those days as well. So again, we're gonna expand the lunch menu until three o'clock, it'll be a more expansive menu just to match Mondays as well. So, Daryl, why don't you give us a couple more updates going on in the golf okay. area? Well, we have uh, all the sand and cedar. So, important job throughout the season. Our members really helped do some sand and seeding. Kramer is going to take control of this program this year. So, he's reached out to a lot of the captains that did it last year. So, for all you captains, just remember, keep in touch with Kramer. For the rest of the community, if you haven't done sand and seed, be on the lookout for an email from Kramer. Uh, and let us know if you want to help on any holes. We'd love to get you out there. Anything we can do to help maintain our golf course. Uh, we're trying to get sand and seed out at least once a week on every hole. So yeah, that's if we great. can do that, we can make it look tremendous. The other thing we have coming up, holiday shopping. So it's right around the corner. Christmas is around the corner. Holidays are around the corner. So come to the golf shop, get your holiday shopping done. We can place special orders if we don't have it in stock now. We also wrap presents. A final reminder before we leave you today, town hall meeting coming up next Friday, 4 p.m. It's gonna be here at the Sundance Room. It's gonna be really a recap of last year, catch everybody up on what's happened from financials to what your board of directors and the committees are really uh, you know, focused in on and uh, the efforts they put out this past year. And then a little bit of sneak peek of what's coming up for this uh, season and what we've already gone through in the first quarter. So again, I hope everybody's had a great week. Look forward to seeing you around the club and until next time, cheers.